Huh? This one won't open either. Well, I guess I'll have to give up. Oh, thanks, G10! This way. Hold on. You're welcome, by the way. Oh, sorry, I forgot when it was automated. Oh, yeah, thank you. Doc, wait. What's this facility for? I know it's a bit late to ask, but... This place was not meant to be seen since the origin of time. This facility centers around the Emperor and the Ministry's longevity experiments. The oh, cool. origin That's of cool. time? Yes. 10,000 years ago, beings called humans were born here. The first were the Emperor and the Ministry's elders. How could a human live 10,000 years? They're oh, just floating heads. Oh, just someone check out. Hasn't, someone also, remember she also, the Emperor is specified, the, the guy with the, with, that sounds very asthmatic. Oh, check out uh, Hyrule. Humans tend to live pretty long over there. His destiny is to never die. All oh, world is him. However, the ministry is different. Once during the Diablo, Di Diablos? Diablos? Diablos. The ministry elders died losing their bodies. Oh. Now, the Solaris governing ministry exists as data in memory banks. Each of their personalities are bits of data. It's the data on the memory bank? Yes, that's yes. what I just said. Yes, having neither flesh nor souls, they are just binary numbers. Have you ever seen Winter Soldier, Faye? I was about to they say, someone's been taking cues from that. They both exist and not exist. After the fall, wanting to resurrect their bodies and create a worthy vessel. Hmm. They transferred a research facility that was once the Soylent system on the land to Entrenank. Entrenank, yes, yeah, so that's uh, the place where we are. Yes. Eventually, the facility was no longer only for the Emperor's life and the Ministry's resurrection. But it began producing food and drugs with add add additives that controlled the public. Of course. The memory cube Faye and, and them were using was meant for obtaining living data. You're talking you see, to me as if I'm not here. Of course, the EFOS also sent various data to help. That means we were living for those elderly people of Gazel? Gazelle. Yes. Sorry, yeah, my bad. Yes. It's all right. They're transferring and taking living data. I guess Tio got so used to everybody yeah, else I saying it that way. <laughs> well, to be fair, it's still my fault in the end. Not distracting. Via memory cubes to the Ministry so they can use them to resurrect That's their bodies. That's right! Our saving mechanic has been helping the bad guys all this time. Again, so... It was well, our fault! So, Tio, <laughs> I'm, yes. so, Tio, I'm curious. What would happen if somebody did, like, a no-save run? It's very yeah. possible to do it at this point. Sure, maybe theoretically using save states and not doing it, but the game doesn't have, you know, contains that con as the contingency. Oh, I get that. That's what I... Uh, Wait, is there a different they? dialogue or oh, no? No, this is important oh. because Ellie has had finally enough. <laughs> Hold on, Faye. Something's not right. Oh, are but we about... to... Okay, but you're going to push me, though. Like, <laughs> Sheetan, how do you know that? Mm -hmm. Oh, of course. Oh, Ellie oh, finally asks. Hey, not just Ellie, anyone. Yeah. Not even the government or the army know such things. Yeah, it's not just their asking. I could Remember, tell you, she's, Ellie. A, she's a first class citizen, you know, so she should actually have enough coverage of information. So the fact that uh, someone knows something that could potentially be so classified is. What? Come to think of it, it seems like we took the long way here on purpose. Hmm. Mm. Yeah, hey, Ellie, it's, um, it's chilly. How about you come into this room with me so we can have that chat? No. The plot was the c was dead the whole time. <laughs> it was a hologram all the time. <laughs> <laughs> there must have been a faster way uh, to Barton, Theo. And what about yeah, that uh, gun that one. literally forces what? you to drive okay, to really kill yourself? That seems a little the, too sinister. The game just calls them, not the others, just them. <laughs> Guess they didn't want to waste the time pretty much spouting everyone's name. Oh, so there's a dam now, is there, Ellie? Also the... Oh. whatever. Also, the route to get to this block can't even be downloaded. downloaded. Huh. Yeah. So how did we know what streets we were on? Mm. Hmm. I could tell she you, She turns a little sus, don't you think? I could, I, I could tell you, Ellie, but if I did, I would have to kill you. Emergency meeting. Doc, didn't you yeah. also find out 
I mean, that's kind of what this is, really. <laughs> that's impossible. You didn't let me finish. Well, you... First of all, that partition we took to get into this block. Period, for some reason? Shouldn't that be like a comma or ellipses <laughs> leading into the next segment? I mean, think Shush. about it. That panel was displayed to be a P force facility. Look, Ellie. If I look, El look, look, Ellie. If I was, if I secretly wanted to kill you, I probably would have done it by this point, don't you think? So I don't know. If playing you the long game, done. people can do that. True. Even a high-ranking officer of Solaris can't get in here. Cheaton, are you the emperor yourself? You'd think they'd leave a facility like that unlocked and open. And there have been no guards on the way. And you could open it. Who exactly are you? Your father. <laughs> oh, shut up. Hey, wait a minute. It could have been... Faye, hey, listen you know to that? the clues. Something's wrong. You were able to get in Solaris under martial law. Ellie, uh, beat, uh, Ellie, hit Faye with your clue stick. I'm sorry, I'm Faye, how do I open a door? <laughs> open sesame! <laughs> Sneak into the palace, get through a P4 level door. Mm-hmm. And even learn the purpose of the P4 facility. How is that possible? It's why is there a good. Why is there it's... a Pedro Dawn facility? And so... <laughs> That's a good question. <laughs> even farther, I'm sure it was possible you were in Solaris then. Surprised mm. it took you this long to finally ask questions, Ellie. Especially given now he was Any acting. Of them. <laughs> was waiting the, the right moment. She so was acting and... sus even before we got to Solaris. And she, and she... As she mentioned, she was starting to have doubts for a while now. She just needed one last bit. Even Jesse, who was also in Solaris then. See, now there's a comma. Richard is very stressed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, of course he is, Shiro. He hasn't slept in months at this point. <laughs> <laughs> Didn't know the motive behind the M project. That well, is true, uh, okay, fine. Okay, fine. I confess. Project M is a terrible game in 2010, and I wanted to keep it from existing. Okay, there. You're, now I said it. I almost read it as Project M, by the way. <laughs> so, Sheetan, <laughs> why do you know? You know even more details than Maria. Oh, big shock! Something's he knows not more right. than Maria. I know it. Remember, oh, cool. well, Maria did knew about the ADM project, Bob. Oh, right, Ellie, she was useful uh, for that. Um... I'm not done. But I'm oh, not boy. done yet. Look, look, trust me, you don't want this Project M video I game to exist. Tempted, trust I me. I was I'm tempted doing to, you a favor. I was tempted to put Corner 2001, but I thought it would have, you know, be too... Oh, okay. on. I should have noticed sooner. Shitan, who are you? I am... Um... Nah, all right, tick. so confront me all this. What is Cheetan and reaction to it? Uh, the lights. <laughs> oh my what, god, he what? Phoenix right us. Hey, you okay, Ellie? Ellie? Oh my god. Cheetan. <laughs> Damn, got us. He's in oh. deep thought. <laughs> Ellie, Cheetan, <laughs> where are you? Honestly, oh, Tio, I think yeah. the corner theme actually yeah. really would have fit for this moment. Uh, uh, oh. Uh, hey, guys, hey, guys. The face entire added to doing that conversation. All that was left was for Faye to turn to the audience and go, Hey, God, hey audience, do you know what they're talking about? <laughs> <laughs> right, maybe maybe, maybe they're in this room, hopefully. That kind of episode of the latent on. Sorry, the latent on Watch it. it end up being locked right behind Ellie. you. Doc, you there? Oh. There oh, dear. Oh, uh, what? Uh, this is... Uh, God, it's a, oh, wait, so it's a bunch of TVs with no signal, so what? What is this, this metagame shit? This is past the, ad, this is past the analog. Oh my so god! It. We're raised up on a platform! More leg blocking to it. Uh, hmm. uh, this is... Can't get it. Huh? This is... Stuff that's been Even happening. Is on the demo, demo value, by the way. What is this? Why are you showing me this? To show you how much of a failure. Who did this? 
Helly, Doc, where are you? Where? <laughs> and there's the ministry on cue. Go ahead, Lavesa. You brought about this spectacle. That voice is the one which haunts you. Cursed, untouchable one. Oh, God's his beloved child, those who prevent our prayers. Get. Bent. <laughs> destroy. What? Burn with God's fire. Wow. <laughs> and Chitin is riding in front of a soul 9000. The doc, these guys, what is this? Bart. Uh. Billy! Are they being experimented Doc, on? What's going the professor on? Professor and Mary Ann. What are you I all? Just... Doc, answer me! Please? Please. Uh, Joba. One of the Solaris Guardian Angels is here. Yuga Rictal. This is my... This is Majesty Ten receiving the orders from the known... and uh, The one known as Emperor. Yeah. You've entered his realm and have been under his continued supervision. I'll wait all Peter for a second, but hold on. Solaris Guardian Angel monitoring me. Waves. No. Oh, yes. We've guided Solaris and even selected the animus which have been drawn to you. And guided you here too, Solaris. Dora. The animus is needed for the resurrection. These are our bodies, and this is what we shall possess. Edge. Yes, this is the uh, only well, reason exists. The bodies of Bart and the others belong to you. Is that true, Doc? What are we saying? You what were all saying? robots. What do you say? Why are you so apprehensive? Is it that you were sold out by one you trusted again? I'm not talking to you guys. Doc, answer me. Three years. Huh? For three years, I have been by your side. Oh, boy. I had to determine whether you were going to be our enemy or not. Revenge? Go up. Yes. yes, the enemy. Your existence is a threat to us. It was necessary to keep an eye on you. Lips. The man who ordered you to be watched was Kay. The Emperor himself. Uh... We were planning on the maturation of the Terminus. I mean, also. And your termination. We also sent Hugo to you. Jova. However, every attempt to terminate you has failed because of that good for nothing trash. Poor Asus. <laughs> Even so, we now possess Aminus. Freya has fulfilled his duty as well. Fix your mic, dude. Is that it? <laughs> you were in with these guys. That's why you. Everyone. Why? You had your way all this time with us land dwellers. You already own the world. What more do you want? Complete segregation. That lives. You must know by now that we plan to resurrect God. Wait a minute. Go. Java? God will awaken from his long slumber after man has been pulled from the earth. Mahanon. Uh, here of Paradise Mahanon, the place fell to the earth. Before I said the command. Paradise. Ha 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 ha. Ha ha ha. That way, that may be proper. May not be proper on Earth. Description. And the Central Black Lord Manon is sealed in. So Wait a minute. That is a source of God's wisdom, a paradise of knowledge. Babes. Using that knowledge, we will resurrect the awakened God and build our Ark to take us both into the great universe. Wow, this is literally the Fabula Nova Crystallis. I was about to say, to reign over God's forces in this great universe, the creation of the angel Ark, the M project, was for that very purpose. What do you mean? <laughs> we are orphans in this important. We are thrown away onto this planet in solitude along with God. Whoops. We humans were not born on this planet. What? Long ago, we came here from another heavenly body. We are beings from an alien planet. And that this alien planet alien. is Earth, isn't it? <laughs> this no, is true. Oh. This is true. You have seen the... Oh, oh, fuck. <laughs> Go on. Why do you think there are no records of humans before 10,000 years ago? Remember what old man Bal said, Jova. 
This is the will of God. The God's revival has been fated since before the time before Genesis. That we will be one with God. Become as gods. Come as gods. <laughs> a new animus, we will once again return to the scary uh, uh, Starry sky is a That is shit. the meaning of our existence. That so, is our supreme objective. So you're not planning on using Solari's power to dominate the world? Lives. Of course! <laughs> what meaning is there in having control of a planet as insignificant as this? God has given us the right to rule over the universe! Jova. Yes, only we who do not carry impure blood have the right to a pardon. Ed. So we will resurrect God. Yes. It has been an eternity since our exile from paradise. If the time of God's survival does not come, we will have to follow the path to destruction. But... Having Jova. attained animus, our resurrection is near. Six is God's resurrection. Kralion! This is the one who only waits for the awakening. But who? Henley! So, this is essentially a mixture of Final Fantasy VII and Final well, Fantasy XIII's villains' plots. Let, let it be your first major revelation. I don't know if you any have considered that part, okay. but yes. This is not, in fact, a post-apocalyptic Earth. This is an alien planet, actually. So yep, so it turns out that <laughs> humans came from the actual planet Earth. Well, we don't know that if that's, uh, that's so actually... How many times right. has Ellie been kidnapped now? Four? Well, everyone has been kidnapped at this point. That lives outside of Cheetan, obviously. And now she gets into a cat scan. Uh, strap yourself in because Craig is about to spoil a lot of techno babble. All right. Yes. Where am I? Allow me to explain. Start, Allow me... Okay, by the looks of it. That's a good question. Allow me to start by explaining you from a, mo a lengthy monologue. I've looked into your records. Oh, God. Krillian? Commander? Yes, very good. Hold on, you can be remembered by name. You know... If uh, I am Van Houten, that incident at the young and one year ago... Remember the flashback oh. she had where she killed people. Case 102, the release of your latent powers from that systematic... administration of mental enhancement drugs, nanomachine snake... Oh wait. It didn't go well. In that instant, in that instant, your AE for value was increased beyond 400. It's over 400. In yeah. that moment, two were critically wounded and three required recycling. As in, they died. Yeah. Am I right? Does that mean they were made into food? You know. Recycling? Yes. <laughs> yes. Please stop. Look, I was hungry. Okay, I had to eat. Anyway, but this record is wrong. What? Oh. This wasn't the usual uncontrollable mental side effect. It was you, your true self all along. This was caused by the awakening of your other inner self. Other inner self. My other self? You're nobody, as it were. Oh, God. Call it whatever you God's want. To... <laughs> no wonder I haven't been liking this plot. <laughs> Where's fate? Where is everyone? Watching you on camera as your secrets are about to be revealed. Eh, you've all done worse. Yeah. Be used as an offering for the resurrection of the Ga the Gazel Ministry. The same fate awaits that girl, the artificial organism. So she we're just calling it Gazel from now on. I've already taken again. enough Gazelle. samples. Right? It's, uh, I'm not gonna give her a name because she doesn't have a soul. I'm already well into the fourth stage of my plan. All I need now is the final factor. Hence, your friends are no longer of any use to me. They're worthless. So I will turn them into meat. But you are different. You're... You're planning on sending them to the same fate as... Also, what's with the spiral music? I know, right? Uh... <laughs> I don't know. Those people in that research facility. Exactly. Which ones? The mutated ones or the ones you ate? Yes. Doing all this for your own selfish ambitions. Do you know what you're doing? She's just probably. playing God. How bad could it be? And they're probably okay with all of it, honestly. Mm -hmm. People playing with other people's lives. 
That's deplorable. Ellie, space, sky, Nazis. That eat sure people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you seen, so you've seen the research facility. Presently, the Solaris researchers are working on genetic engineering down there. It's just a nest for fools who've learned the despicable pleasure of playing with their own organic creations. They seek only serendipity and inhumanity. That is not my place. I specialize in molecular engineering, nanotechnology. Do I need so a see? Now? So see, weird. I'm not as bad as them. That's why I'm giving him the liquid snakes voice. Hello? Do you know what this is? A nano machine. A mo <laughs> this is the assembler, which is one of those nano machine machines. Redonna, he, he ate the thesaurus. <laughs> 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 I'm not a machine. Not a machine. machine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, the pause is because they Truly a game. weapon to surpass Metal Gear. That's an Adam's. And we could shut it into anything. Yep, that's nano machines, alright. Listen, let him have his speech. He's waited a long time for this. Each of these spheres. Until recently, we were all in the Do you know how much I've rehearsed this speech? The players <laughs> were shown several times the size of this. Thanks to that girl, the one we obtained for the ruins of the z boy civilization. Just in case you forgot. We are now able to make it this compact and elaborate. Unfortunately, Emeralda Speed has sped up a lot of research with Kraven was I to have. Yeah. To think that such a mechanism was created 4,000 years ago, it's quite astonishing. Up until we discovered this, the work was rather crude. Hmm. The best we could possibly do until now was to apply amino acid uh, solutions to one of the wounded areas for amelioration or to seal up any peculiar ability. I'm sure you've had some exposure to genetics when you were in the Jugend. Are you familiar with cloning? Each type of those enzymes inside the DNA are also molecular machines that were created by nature. That is, if we are indeed the progeny of the very first organism. In English, please? Hmm. What do you th what do you think of accomplishing by using that molecular machine? Hmm. I just tell you. <laughs> what connection do I have with it? That, that is actually a good question. Why, why is that it's so, so specific? Although the nanomachines up until now could recombine DNA. They couldn't uncover any information in the intron, which are located in the replacements. Uh-oh. As in the, the deepest part. Of the double helix. Double helix? The However, the newer, the newer machines easily discovered this data. Data that originally should not have existed, and we are about to see the results of that. Oh, dear. Is such a variation in genetic code? Hmm. According to the transfer record, it depicts a similar wave frequency as expected. And yes, the Eurobolas ring. There, that's the last of the Krami exposition. Thank you very much. <laughs> that is it, isn't it? Miang and Lacan's actions. This explains everything. We will need to totally, yeah. that explanation. And um, you were the mother. Oh my god! I barely know who my own mother is. <laughs> Wait, out, so... Of all of wait, wait, wait. So you're telling story. me that we were all on a Jeremy Clark show all along? Java, it's... we only scratched not even the surface of this. This is the conceptualized form of the intron, which carries information that isn't supposed to exist. Observe, this is the Eurobolas ring, which contains intron information, which only exists in certain people. Eurobolas, if we were if, to anatomize such a thing. The Eurobolas, <sighs> in case you don't know, is a concept in stuff like alchemy, but these are serpents that might be stored. that. You this is a lot of learning? word vomit, huh? I'm, so, I'm sorry, I have to say what Krillin just said. Wouldn't you be interested in, in hearing about all this information? Uh -huh. Ellie, you are beautiful. When I look at you, I appreciate the artistic aspect of the human form. It's elaborateness. I can help, I can Whatever help you say, dude. The, I can't help but feel the importance. But I thought we weren't look, humans. As if my molecular machine is more Look, I'm just appreciating the actual that's, physical uh, aspect. That's, that's actually another potentially clue. The fact that Krian seems to be 
almost morbidly attached to, to studying early. Mm, wonder why. Could that mean that? Wait a minute, wait a minute. You didn't get enough hugs from Hold on. Morgan. Whatever you're gonna say, no. Because we still don't know that line. Oh, okay. look who is here now. Just nice of you to show up, douchebag. Okay, okay, now, uh, now I'm getting Attack of the Clones flashbacks. No, no, this is fake. It's a terrible thing. You can't too far. This is madness. Are you conscious? Fuck. It is impossible to move. This machine has physically cut your nerve signals. That's a bummer. Huh. To quote Craig Ferguson, there, that's the last of the crummy exposition. Thank you very much. If they will not be able to lift a finger. So, what are you stop. gonna do to me to part in them? Where is Adley? Do not worry. They have their roles. You have yours. This is not a stage theater play. <laughs> I simply investigate. Damn me, this. What was I? <laughs> so, the battle has been fought, you say? Oh. We'll investigate this, raises middle finger. That was discussed earlier by the Ministry. God damn it, we were important to be used by them. Apparently you we, were. We didn't come all the way to Solaris for that. I, we, everyone, we just want to make a place where we belong. That's what we were fighting for. But now... It is much easier to be given a place to belong than to make one yourself. You do not even understand a simple concept like that. Only the true. Childish ideals pale when placed before reality. But actually, many are satisfied with that. Being given one's place frees one from any risks. Chitan, are you actually going anywhere with this? Misfortunes may be blamed on others. Do you know why people cannot exist alone, but only under some bigger concept such as a group or a country? People need a place to go to be themselves. The more stable it is, the more effective it is. The ministry gives them such a place. Nothing about any of this is stable. Under total surveillance, there is no need to bear the risk of maintaining one's own individuality. They simply live under the delusion of being an individual. What could be easier? So Not being mutated my... and turned into Basically. food? Fats are fats, so let's just accept them. It will be easier for all of us. Resistance is futile. It only makes things painful. I... I... Do you still intend to do something about it? Look at yourself. What do you think you could possibly do at this stage? You cannot move. So you can't even look at yourself. You could not even protect your friends who follow you when they needed you. You could not even protect the most important person in your life, Ellie. And we literally got yeah. duped by the lights being turned yes. off. This yeah, is kind you, of embarrassing. Yes, this is not the fourth time you failed Stop, to do that. Please. Can't wait till he breaks him out. You can do nothing. Quit it. Oh. Now, we may take our time and talk. I. Id. Oh, he's literally <laughs> called Id. I get it. We'll just oh, yeah, have Id. to wait okay. for the rest of the conversation later. All right, then. Now, Korean takes a bit of a break uh, in order to have someone else uh, interact with Ellie. Oh! It's Ramsus. Uh... Hmm. Oh, hi. Commander? It's been a while, hasn't it? What are you... For if in case it's a bit hard because it's a bit pixel and everything, he grabbed their their hand, their, their arm. What? Where? I'm asking you, where? Where what? That that hurts. Please stop it. Green soldier, and you hurt you from a simple shoulder grab. You're pathetic. He's grabbing her hand. Where is he? Where? Where like is he? I know you know. Like Take me to him. I kind of can't move from here right now. Yeah. That's not an excuse. Who are you referring to when you say that man? Are you talking about Faye? It's just, it's just from this perspective, Jover, it looks like a shoulder. 
It does, yeah. Although Tia clarified. Mm -hmm. <laughs> no, specifically the arm, like, say, around potentially the shoulder. Fay, Fay, Fay this and Fay that. Mm. I mean, you asked. Fay, in what way is he superior than I? I will oh, not boy. accept it. I will not. <sighs> okay, so inferiority <laughs> complex. Ramses, that drug. A mental stabilizer? Oh boy. Oh no. to literally functional on painkillers, basically. Why are you so shook up like that? What's forcing you to go through all this? The drugs, Ellie. The hash. Oh god, he's high and has an inferiority complex. Not a good combination. Oh. Only the most stable people around Solaris. <laughs> <laughs> what happened between you and Faye? He took my weed! And he took my wife. Damn it, Faye! I'll show you! I will show you on the moon! <laughs> I'm not old! I'm not Damn. old! <laughs> Best pegs, bye! What the fuck was that? Ramses, what the fuck was that all about? <laughs> Just show up, rants about how much she hates Faye, and then that's it. Okay, let's like elaborate. Said, we, will learn, we will learn the rest of the conversation between Faye and Cheetah later, but for the time being, we have to cut a bit later. Wait, so we're going ahead to the future? Slightly ahead. It's you, uh, Jova. Hey, hang in there. Hey, look at that. <laughs> hey, look at that. We're out. It's huh? Boss of Bart and Billy. Faye, hey, you're conscious. Now, let's go! All part and of the plan! And runs to Sheet's head and beats the shit Punch out of Sheet's head in the face. <laughs> you traitor! Yeah, exactly. That's what he's gonna do. <laughs> Ed, st stop! Faye! Hey. Don't stop, Bart. He betrayed us. He betrays us and Ellie. Stop! Faye, hey, it's your mistake. Wait, what? Why? <laughs> Let go! Let me go! I need to punch him in the face! I mean, Hey, your look. feet are still oh, free no, kicking! No, no. Calm down, Faye! Bot at nine! Chitan is the one who helped us! What? Billy? Oh, no, no, this is also a hmm. If Billy says it, you listen. That's not the point, Bart! <laughs> wow. I mean, no, no, actually, some explanation. Shouldn't that have a I, comma? I actually like that line, actually. Listen very carefully. That limiter is implanted in our bodies. Right now, this research facility is the only place where we can get them removed. Cheetah misled Krellian and the other guys and brought us in here to remove the limiter, that son of a bitch! What? But Doc was just... Is that true? Yeah! Yeah. That's it, you can still hit him. He's kind of been a Doc. bit of a dick even before. That is not the only reason why I brought you here. Oh, really? I brought you here so I can insult you without consequence. Those who want to be in the Pen of Solaris must know the actual situation. And it's you true may be eating human flesh. Bro, well, what the hell? Must, that we have bigger fish to fly with. Right I, I received a covered order from the Emperor. When, 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 when the ministry and center. If the possible, bring the body back. That was my duty. As a result, I had no choice but to deceive you. Please forgive me. How? <laughs> You. <laughs> no, I'm not, I'm not forgiving you. I will have to venture also this a bit later as well because unfortunately the game is just tell, telling it a, a bit, you know, briefly. Besides, I myself had a matter that had to be verified in this facility. Would Look, you at least tell us that? For sure. Look, it was either that or, or let them he kill you. Wearing... I'll, I'll tell you that after we escape from here. It is something you must know. <laughs> <sighs> Oh, Cheetan, Cheetan, Cheetan. By the way, Cheetan, you did remove Faye's limiter, didn't you? No. What? Yes, of course. That is. Uh... Cheetan! Ah, okay, okay, don't worry, don't worry, I'll mention this in a second. Don't worry after the dialogue's over. Okay, now you can hit him, Faye. Alright then. Bart! He literally stuttered! Wait, what happened to Ellie? Weren't you with her? <laughs> Ellie was taken to Krellin's research lab. It could not be stopped. 
Well, crud. Oh, shut up, you let it Crazy happen. Shit. I, I am sorry. Why only Ellie? I do not know. Are you sure you don't know? The one thing bothers me. When Kralian took Ellie, I had a chance to acquire Ellie's cellular information. I analyzed it and found something very interesting. Excuse me, I, I mean, unusual. Why did you have- oh god. God, you're weird. There is no limiter implanted in her. Has no limiter? Isn't that because Ellie is from Solaris? No. no. Even Solaris citizens have a limiter implanted when they are reborn. This is why Ellie needed it to be removed for the seven limiter technique. There are exceptions for certain people like myself and Ramses, whose limiters can be removed later on through the treatment such as the one I did for Bart. But you must have permission from the Ministry to do so. Instead, why Ellie? There must be more to it than that. I don't know the reason. But Krylin is so absorbed by her data. I don't care what the reason is. For now, let's help Ellie and get out of here fast. You're right. If we mess up here, I put those guys who went to help Ellie's parents in danger. Oh! Cheetan, we're going to Krellian's private research lab, as planned. We'll meet up at the rendezvous point. Sounds good. What about Doc? What about Doc? There is still something left to be done. I will go destroy the last gate. I swear. That is true, we need to do that. Uh, with Doc, a sword? Yes, Yui gave it to me as I was leaving. I used to I used to use it before I met her. For a long time I vowed not to use it for killing though. Oh, but killing people on arm was fine. But now is not the time to contemplate morals. It is not fair for me to be the only innocent. You were one. never <laughs> innocent. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I see, sir. You but... pretentious. <laughs> You're always so mischievous, Doc. You don't say it's not the right word. Oh, no, no, no. It is in my nature. I'm sorry. Forgive me. <laughs> you are lucky I don't have a gun. Oh wait, no, Billy does. <laughs> now that the limiter is removed, Solaris doesn't stand a chance. Right. You did get removed the limiter, right? Oh, yes. By the way, young one, about the effects of removing the limiter. The results will not show up that quickly. Already your physical limiters have been removed uh, naturally. By Gaspar. The part I have removed is the psychological section. That is, the subconscious fear and veneration from the Ministry and the Emperor have been removed. Basically, you will be able to battle against them without any fears or hesitations. Okay, this is all well and good, but can we still punch him anyway? Because I think he still deserves it a little yes. bit. Yes! Not... <laughs> just give me a second, don't worry. Are you serious? Yeah, Look, well, I... alright, let me explain this. Actually, no, no, I will explain after technically the part is over, because for the time being, we are technically starting the third, the, the last third of the dungeon, as I mentioned, where we need to essentially gather the rest of the party while Cheetan goes to destroy the gate. Look, if, look, look, I could have told you from the get-go what was my- oh, sorry. According to Cheetan, Krellian's private laboratory should be below us. Okay. Alright, I, I, I could have told you- I could have told you from the get-go what was my plan all along, but what would be the fun in that? I really do get the feeling that this is tied in heavily with that opening cutscene of the game. Ellie! You okay? Uh, oh, you remember that? Yes! Faye, hey, yes. Yes, I'm fine. That's right, the, 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 like you said, it would have to become important at some point. What did you do to the commander, though? He has a big issue with you. Uh, sorry to interrupt you two, but this is not the time for a heartfelt reunion. Quickly! Well, he asked us if she's way. okay. <laughs> a man all under the place where Kralian's study is? What? Look, this guy had an escape plan pod for his escape Meanwhile, pod. Jesse and the uh, cheat are in the gate. What took you so long? I only got so many bullets. Hurry up and blow them away. I am sorry. I have other matters to attend to. Of you course dick! You do, for fuck's sake. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? Cheetan is a dick to everyone. <laughs> to his majesties. Main the Emperor? Are you sure, Hugo? Yes, His Majesty understands the situation. He says to leave it up to them. Yeah. There. 
It is done. Sir! You, you know, I, I like how he was just... Yes! We're out of here! Huh? Oh, Ooh. no, it's Ramses. He forgot he went to basically school with these guys. Yeah. Where is he? You got... Are? So you too, you are also betraying me. Everybody betrayed me. I'm for that <laughs> <one. laughs> are, We are just in different situations. I did not mean to betray you. I decided to stick with Faye's group. I didn't Drop mean to betray head. you. I just chose the one. Wait, did you say Faye? You oh God. two are on his side. <laughs> I'll never forgive you. Never. Faye. Car. You're an enemy, but why are you so attached to Wonky? That's creepy as fuck, man. <laughs> you weren't like that before. Shut up! I've got to get him with my own hands! And all of you working with him are my enemies! Enemies! I hate all of you. Stealing my things! Enemies! 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 Okay, <laughs> <laughs> sit down, let's talk about this. Hey, we're going. Not Look now. Up. I don't know what went on, but I don't have time to deal with it now. <laughs> <laughs> I'm too sober for the shit. Kill her. And that's saying something given it's Jesse. I see. Sorry, Carl. <laughs> hey, yeah, we just, we just leaving to, to run like that. Uh, not to run, but busy. Leave it to contemplate that while the gate is exploding next to him. Okay. While the frame rate dies, unfortunately. Yeah. <laughs> I don't want to shoot him first. <sighs> you traitors! Damn you, Faye! That's Rosus. That's mistreated by everyone. <laughs> But uh, let me explain this. Uh, um, again, I will elaborate much more um, later on for for the for the fine prints. Uh, but Cheetah will officially explain his proper stance uh, um, two parts from now, officially, because the party still needs to get out of the oh. now. It needs to get out of Solaris, so, so there's unfortunately not much time. Um, but um, I don't know if you did notice, uh, but uh, while not proper confirmation, there's at least the strong implication that he kind of made up the whole second limiter removal thing just to be in the graces of a party again. Wow, so yeah, because the limiters were technically already removed. That's what we and, know and about. The, and keep in mind, two things. Even when the Escobar phase said, oh, he stumbles, and he says, oh, sure, sure, I already moved it. And when it comes to telling uh, Bart the effects, he said, oh, it's just a psychological effect. You will be able to not have fear, which really sounds like <laughs> bullshit, admittedly. Now, now, uh, unlike the previous beats, uh, for which it will, there will be probably the supposed explanation two parts from now. Um, Chitan did this just to be sure, but at the very least, it is because he wants to be sure just, you know, that the others, uh, you know, trust him for this occasion. He doesn't, for the, at least he doesn't want to backstab them potentially again, you know, um, on that front. So you want to trust me for the time being on this. So I kind of have... Is a, is, it's a double agent, basically. Triple well, triple case, agent, I actually. Yeah. I kind of had a yeah, feeling that I kind of had a feeling he was going to be a triple agent because, well, thinking with the way of how JRPGs usually think, well, he wouldn't have been playable if he was a traitor. The and... of series usually will play also with this kind of trope. Oh boy, this is a bit more egregious, admittedly. And to be um, fair, like, well, this game is older, so you know, I was expecting that. Okay, either it was going to be that he was a triple agent, or it turned out that he was under mind control, and then we had to bust him out, and that's how he okay. would remain to be playable. Before, also before we end the part, uh, uh, two things. Um, uh, one, let me dump the artwork of the day. It's not actually themed and, you know, with now, but it's uh, an interesting piece. Uh, like, normally the, the rest of Perfect Works tends to have character portraits and concept arts that are, you know, official, you know, borderlands and everything. But when we have this amusing concept arts for Faye, which is just labeled as 
Faye suggests. What? What is suggesting? That's the meme. Guess, uh, is, to, is to get the, yeah, if anything, everybody of those listen here, you little shit memes from Doctor Who. Yeah, I was gonna uh, say, this looks like, this looks like a meme. <laughs> I know, right? And why does Faye look so old in this one? Like, and dang. say. Yeah, I'm gonna see Dej use this <laughs> on his Twitter link. <laughs> Dej, next, next profile change, uh, come on. Um, but let me also explain, right before we end the part, uh, about the um, the sword thing. Unfortunately, the details were, uh, were actually cut uh, part of you know part of that backstory of Cheetan that was one of the things that got sadly cut away. It's not much, but it's a bit sad because Cheetan was one of the more complete characters, but he still had to excise part of his backstory. Man, so even Cheetan got hit comes. by it. That's surprising, well, given how important. That in itself is not important. What you really just need to know is the fact that he used to actually, you know, use a sword um, before a long time ago. But after he encountered Yui, his, his wife, he essentially stopped using because of some weird, you know, bizarre morals, you know, that basically told, basically had him apply the a sword of Hippocratic oath and not killing, you know, uh, things with his sword. Killing them their hands was fine, apparently, though. So... And he calls himself the innocent yeah, one. <laughs> Look. Okay. But uh, you will be able to see that properly in the next part. But uh, yes, uh, you also this affects Look. gameplay because this revamps Cheetan's moveset completely and makes it even more busted. Really? Look, look, look. Faye and Ellie, look. No. I could have just let you two fall victims to these people, but I didn't, did I? Come you know, Titan, Titan, we appreciate what you did for us, but did you have to do it in such a dickish manner? And did you have to let us eat people just to supposedly give a speech yeah, about the, the, it? The, the, Bart, the whole... Bart. Uh, so, sorry, not, not Bart, Young One. He calls him Young One. Young One, <laughs> think about think about it. I'm a triple agent. I can't allow the other. I can't allow the fucking ministry to realize that I'm actually betraying them. You know, okay. you know, you know. There is a point to being a little too dedicated to the role, yeah, though. He was way too into the role, like seriously. Anyway. <laughs> Anyway, unfortunately, again, um, we only just started scratching also the reveal of information. Trust me on that. Uh, well, this is the first of a major info dump that you're getting. Um, it's still it's still going to be a big oh, iceberg great. to go through. Um, the oh, next great. Part... More, more crummy exposition? <laughs> yeah, you know, in a technical sense, yes. But with a, song, with a touch of less techno babble. I will say this. I think I'm definitely starting to get the real picture and how this ties in with the opening cutscene of the game. Trust me, you still you still don't. Uh, but uh, in in the next part, uh, we complete uh, technically our escape from Solaris. Uh, but we'll have to see how successful it will be. See ya. See ya. Yeah, yeah.